Ladies and gentlemen of the online world, today we are gonna be filling up our planters with some soil. Now you may be wondering what kind of soil. So I went out and I bought some all-purpose compost and some all-purpose planting mix. And I'm just gonna start digging up all this. I'm gonna make a beautiful, scientifically crafted ratio of potting soil, compost, and some gross dirt you find in your backyard. I'm gonna time lapse now. Uh, I'm not even close to being there. Just got a little bit in each one. I have this one. This is just from over there earlier. Important thing is this is a power outlet line in the ground. I don't want to put a shovel through that. And to be safe, I'm going to turn it off. All right, there we go. Other things to watch out for, sprinkler lines, obviously a drainage line here. So don't dig into those. And if you're really worried and you're kind of a nerd, call 411 before you dig. All right, time to do some more digging. So I got that wheelbarrow in. I'm gonna keep filling these up. I just fell in a hole. Um, until at least like the halfway lines on these, which I don't know if that's exactly halfway, but it's pretty close. So I'm gonna keep using this soil and then I'm gonna start mixing in the planting mix and the compost. So that's just like more of the top layer because the plants that we have at least right now, they're not gonna be this deep in the soil anyway. So this is more just like filler. 100% mountain spring water for the Western United States and weird down in the dirt all of that too all right i got these about halfway filled up i'm gonna level them out a little bit and then we're gonna start adding the potting soil and the compost chicken manure fillers i feel like chicken would be good i like chicken all right how are you supposed to open these i don't want this the way and scissors Use scissors like this. Perfect. Goodbye, scissors. Open her up. Ooh, it's warm. Smells like mm, cows. And pull out. And pull. And flip. Now just pull. Pull. Flip. Chug. All done. And spread out. I'm not trying to have this over the actual level of the box here because when I water it, then it will overfill. So it looks pretty good though. I'm not actually gonna mix this in now. Everything below it to so get a good mix. My friends who were twigs. All gone. All right, so that was one bag of planting potting soil mix each. So now I think I'm just gonna take one bag of this compost, divide it in half, put that half in each. I still have some big like planting buckets plus these pots I want to use for like tomatoes. So I want to save some of the other stuff for that. And we'll probably have extra um, potting mix in the end since I have three more bags. And I probably won't use all that. Okay. Half over here. Uh oh. Yep. Okay. Half of this one.
and a little more than half of this one since it already spilled out. Perfect. Spread the compost around, mix it into the topsoil, the planting mix, and we look like we actually have a pretty good mix here now. Of a lot of things that should hopefully make it grow. Why does that not go in? This hoe sucks. It's a bad hoe. Um, yeah. So we're looking pretty good. I think next up, I be planting some plants. But that is going to take some research to figure out which one needs to go where. Yes. All right. You know what? That's it. I throw in the hoe. Thank you for watching today's video on how to add dirt to a wooden box. My name is Scott. Signing out.